Yo, what's good, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Is it? No, it's a different one. Or is it? Same motherfucking box. Nah, it's no, a it's, a, it's a different one, dummy. It's a second attempt. Yeah, back to the difference. Uh, so we're over here at Kev's. Um, look how fucking monstrous. This is what. This one's fatter, huh? Yeah. This is what Jonathan just bought yeah, for his SRT for the neon. AGP powered, you know what it is. Um, damn, this shit is fat. <laughs> Hella wide. Fuck, now let's see if we're so. Here's the stock one, you guys can see. This shit is hella small Just and skinny. Look at so. that shit. That <laughs> shit is fucking it? like it. it. It's coming in today or tomorrow. Put the other one on top so we can see the difference. Just a stock V8. <laughs> stock V8? Stock neon? Yeah. Just a stock neon. This shit is fucking fat, yo. Booty action right here. This camera is sick. This shit no. is fucking Put this fat, one in yo. the bottom. Put this in the bottom. Huh? Oh, shit. Put that one in the bottom so we can see how much thicker it is. But yeah, boy Jonathan finally doing some power mods. Well, this doesn't do much power, but it's gonna help the car keep cooler, huh, bro? Huh, bro, for what you're gonna do real soon? But, but look at this shit, bro. Hopefully, um. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment section. Put it, let's see how it looks. All right, here we give up. <laughs> Just the neon. Ooh, that how looks mean, huh? Yeah. That bitch looks mean. Just waiting on that. Go. Just waiting on that um, dual ball bearing 80 mil turbo. Sheesh. Get up to 600 horsepower. How much are you gonna be running? 500? Around there. Pushing like 500. 500 horses. What happened? Just finished the job. Almost, almost. But everything is back, bolted up and into place. Nice and sturdy. Oh, the... What? Back into place, oh. dummy. No, or what I said? No, that's what you said. What did I say? That's what I said, mm, dummy. No, oh, the couplers are back. For all, you and, guys are, and for all of you guys that are just starting, this tool really helped me a lot. So I recommend this. No more fucking having it's to huh? yeah, it's be worth struggling. A investment. Not too expensive either. Milwaukee too. One of the best brands out there. Not sponsored, but if you guys want to sponsor the channel, hit us up. How huh, bro? True, true. But yeah, once you go in big intercooler, you won't be able to run the crash bar. So that is trash. I mean, at least it looks better, huh, bro? Yeah, we don't need it. No, <laughs> nah, I don't want to say it. I know, I know, don't say it, bro. <laughs> but, um, time to put the bumper back on, huh, bro? See how it looks. like that for a day or two. All right, put the hood down. Let's see how it looks, No bumper. Bro. No bumper? Showing the big-ass intercooler off. There you go. Sheesh. Like that, asking for a stay ref or what? Asking for a stay ref? Fuck a stay ref, dude. Fuck a 30 day? Okay. Looking for some wheels right now, so bother me. Uh, shit. Also, oh, what do you want to say about this intercooler? Huh? You recommend it? It was easy to install, huh? About this intercooler? Yeah. Yeah, it was dope. Because with the other one, we couldn't get it on. Too experienced. I'm going to take this off, yeah. too. The mesh? Can yeah, I? take it off, yeah. Just leave these. To expose it more here. Dude, yeah, like but this is this ain't mine, but I recommend this one over some other cheap ones because this shit was easy to install. It came with the holes for the for this shit, for the support. Um the outlets lined up perfectly. Should we tell them about the other intercooler or not? 
No, I didn't because I had to. Yeah, okay, so. <clears throat> so, at the beginning of the week, we tried to install some other fucking intercooler that Jonathan bought. But that shit didn't line up. The, the inlets or outlets, whatever they're fucking called, didn't line up. And it was hitting the the radiator, huh, Kevin? This wasn't getting me up to face, huh, Okay, bitch? you guys tried it twice? Well, we tried it twice. What? We couldn't get it. We tried cutting shit. We uh, we had to do uh, our own fucking hose, too. No, it's because it's the, it's the 3D one. So oh, yeah? It looks close, but you're not like... 3D? No, not 3D. Uh, it pops out? The, uh, no, not 3D. We have 3D on the channel now? The, what's it called? Who? The white angle? Oh, yeah, white angle. How do you go that to fucking 3D, <laughs> bitch? Music? These, huh? Nah. Oh, yeah. Take, huh? Yeah. Oh, but the CX Racing oh, one, the it comes with the holes, it comes with the um, shit. It's just like, plug and play, so I recommend this one for your SRT4 for the bug. This is the best option out there. But uh, he's taking off the mesh, Why are you off so the mesh you for can it? see the intercooler more. All the fucking bugs are gonna go in there. Oh fuck, oh fuck. The wind, the wind. Ooh, that shit looks clean. Sheesh. That shit looks massive. What you think, bro? <laughs> fuck with it. It looks sick, it looks sick. Big ass in the cooler. Auto tricks is gonna be um, proud, huh, bro? Yeah. <laughs> Every neon needs a big inner cooler out here. Huh, bro? Fuck this talking. Kinda small. You gotta scare niggas with this big ass one. Sheesh. Let me know what you guys think. Comment down below. Tap in, tap in. Alright, fellas. So we're done. We just finished. Everything was pretty smooth. I'd say like overall, this job is pretty easy. It took us about like an hour, but it's just that we just started chilling and talking. Don't forget the shaver. I need a shaver, bitch. I'm just trying to race like, I don't know, four bangers. I'm not ready to come out for V8 yet though. Soon, soon, soon. Let me know what you guys think about the intercooler, though. If you guys have a neon, do it to yours. I recommend it. Yo, they say you'll gain like about 10, 15, 10, 11 around their horsepower. Best intercooler for your buck. Yeah. Oh, have you? If you don't. If you got a lot of money, let me talk. Right, bro. Okay, go ahead. Sorry. If you have a lot of money, you can go with the Mopar. I mean the um, the modern performance intercooler, but shit, I was like, fuck it. I ain't gonna spend that much because it was like $47 of shipping. So I just went with the eBay one and they told me that CX Racing does a good intercooler as well. So here they it do is. The same job, so. It looks just the same as the modern performance and I guess it does the same fucking job. So for like $100 less and like free shipping as well. So, yep. I'll leave the uh, link down below for the intercooler, though. Or not. Yeah, okay. Sheesh. Use promo code on the estimated for 10% <laughs> off. <laughs> it is. Right. We're not there yet. That's, that's going to be it. If you guys want to sponsor us, hit us up. Sheesh. My boy wore the shirt. I just noticed. He should have. I should have wore the same one, too. Mechanic shirt. This is our mechanic tee. We got short sleeves too, but I don't know why he's not wearing the short sleeve one. It's fucking hot out here. Coming out soon. 
Oh yeah, and um, a little update. I took off the CCWs, cause um, and threw the threw the Arhans back on because, just like CCWs are too wide. CCWs, you can't race in those. Those are just for like show show wheels. If anybody's interested in the CCWs, you can hit me up on my Instagram, and uh, we'll see if I can get you a good deal. <laughs> Just remember they're CCWs. Three real. Piece, three piece. Three man. piece reels. No fake shit here. And I rebuilt two because I fucking got in an accident. <laughs> Don't fresh lips? Yeah, I put two fresh lips. Don't text and drive though, that's all I gotta say. I <laughs> <laughs> comment, like and subscribe, yeah, bro. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Sheesh. Eric. Oh, fuck.